Right. Obama uses kids as human shields. The Democrats use kids as human shields. He brings these kids, supposedly who wrote letters to the White House after Newtown, bring them up there to um, present a picture of support among the children. Rosh Limbaugh today, back with me now, Daniel Lash and Scotty Hughes. Scotty Hughes, why shouldn't President Obama bring these children to the White House to illustrate a point that he's making these proposals now in direct relation to the slaughter of children. Well, why sit here and, and say that these to bring these children up on stage and give them high fives and then sit there your White House claims that the NRA ad exploits his own children. I mean, across the board, he is exploiting children. He sat there and is complaining double standard completely. He brought his children on every chance he could during the campaign. And now his White House is coming and saying this new NRA ad is actually attacking his children and that's just wrong. Hands off my kids. Same thing he did today with those four. And to your point here, I'll be honest with you, people own tanks. People own cannons. Heck, people own jet fighters. When was the last time you heard a crime done by one of those people? Okay, Dana Lash, let's uh, ask you that question, uh, which is about the magazine clips. Do you think that there's any reason why any civilian needs a magazine uh, or a magazine drum, as it is now, of a 10-round limit or more? Uh, I, I think that there exist reasons that uh, exactly why we should have more than I know what what New York spans seven I, I can think of a story that uh, just a headline that just hit the uh, the papers today in New York There was a man who was attacked by a gang of men with bats and tire irons uh, There were I believe more than seven of those individuals that attacked him I can think of that well, what's, your, what's the point of that of that anecdote? and also and also Piers you also well, have then, to why, why do you tell that story? Well, because it's 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 to highlight that if someone has a firearm and they're able to defend themselves, and have you have seen that video? Attacker, have you seen the or, video? Or I I've seen screens. Actually, I've seen screens. Okay, I've actually it. I've actually but taken Pierce, the trouble to. Pierce, well, hang on, Pierce, hang on, no, hang you, on. You can't just say these things. I took the trouble to watch that whole video. Yes. An unfortunate ahead. man involved in a pizza mm -hmm. argument at 5 a.m. in the street gets attacked by a group of people who were clutching a, a bar of some sort. And Tire else. iron. Yeah, but he's alive. He didn't get killed. He wasn't shot. Is your solution to that fight in a street? I made and we don't a know suggestion. Who caused it I didn't say what. it was a solution. Is your suggestion that someone should have pulled a gun out and shot somebody? If you have to defend yourself against, uh, yourself against more than one attacker, then absolutely. And Piers, you also have to. Th have you ever fired? Oh, have you so, fired so, a weapon? So that young man should have shot those people. I'm not saying that. I'm saying that if someone has, what are you there saying? There are then? instances where there is more than one people, more than one person coming at you. There is an instance where you have uh, a gang of me, individuals coming at you. Okay, let me but ask Pierce, you this. Here's well, the thing. Let me ask you if this. the founding Dana, fathers what, what wanted you... this limited, they would have enumerated that in okay, the Okay, we've already amendment. established you don't believe there are limitations. So that's fine. So everyone okay. can have a tank. Why would anybody? <laughs> why would anybody need an AR-15? Have you ever can, fired one? Yes, I haven't fired one. No. Why would anyone need an AR? Okay. Well, let me tell well, you right Dana, now. Let me just finish I my question. I want to answer this because let me finish honest, my question. Piers, this will help nobody, so much. This nobody, so much. Let me help. Let me, let, me let me ask the question. Okay. Go ahead. Why would anybody need an AR-15 that has a magazine with a hundred bullets in it, as with the shooter at Aurora? Why would anybody need that? Well, first and foremost, if you've never fired an AR-15 as a woman who also has self-defense, has uses guns for self-defense and likes to know that I have that security, they're a lot easier to fire than than other rifles. So simply you, because you, of the you think women should all be armed with AR-15s? My goodness! Now, are you going to go off on a tangent every single time I say one thing? You just go I'm off to and make up another. What you actually Come on believe. now, Pierce. Stay with me here. Stay here I'm with me. I'm trying to clarify what you believe. Well, I'm trying to explain it to you, but you keep putting words in my mouth every time I try. So stop. Let me finish, and we'll get somewhere with this. No, an AR-15 is, honestly, it's just like any other rifle. I don't understand why some individuals can become so scared of this, because they think it's a scary-looking weapon. Uh, it's not, this is not like the military-style assault rifle that, you know, fully automatic or capable Americans. of select fire. It shot 70 the, the, Americans in a movie theater in 90 seconds. It murdered uh, a group of New York State firemen. Do you know there are, there are pistols? It killed there, there 20 school children by, in by an elementary Armalite. school. Yes, but this particular weapon has been used in the last four mass shootings, and still nobody can explain to me why how any are civilian needs that. Why for that, one Pierce? of these high-capacity magazines? Pierce, I don't how, get are how are law-abiding citizens like me responsible for that? I followed the law. And I'll, I'll admit it, I own an AR-15. I follow yeah, James the law. Holmes I, was a law I went through my background James check. Holmes was I've a taken the classes. Dana, I'm a responsible James owner. Holmes, Why should I be punished? James Holmes was a law-abiding citizen. He bought his guns legally. He bought the ammunition mm. over the internet. And he went and shot 70 Americans in a movie theater. 
So I'm afraid when but the NRA, when no, the NRA no, Pierce, says Pierce, taking our Pierce. guns, attacking no. our guns, and said no. today, the, wait, the NRA said no. today, attacking mm -mm. our guns will only hurt law-abiding gun owners. I like, want to focus on something you just said, Pierce. I want to focus on that. He I, was, he me was finish, on Dana. medication, do and he was seeing a psychiatrist. Dana, I don't dispute he, that. No, let me answer this. I want to bring this up. This is an important point, Pierce, and it needs to be made. No, here's the thing. This is where the people who are supposed to enforce the law fail. But Adam Lanza's mother did not shoot people up, Pierce. You have to realize that. And, Pierce, you need to realize, too, that this is where the people who are supposed to be telling... See, look, I'm going to use the case of Jared Loeffner as an example. Do you realize that that he could have been reported in terms of being mentally unfit reported to NICS when they did the background check they would have determined that he was mentally unfit he would have been unable to purchase a firearm the same thing with Holmes but you have these laws in place Piers what good are laws if they are if no one wants to follow Scotty, them Scotty, do you realize Scotty, that, no, do you realize that, she, that there are laws Scotty that ha have been earlier, passed to incentivize states Scotty reporting these people she, to NICS okay, I hear you. Scotty said earlier she doesn't agree with a single thing that President Obama said today what's your view is there anything there you agree with? You know, I, I'm really trying, because I think that he was moved by what happened at Newtown, which I think anybody would have been. Was there but anything the you agreed time, with in the president's proposals? No. Okay. And instead you know, of today, instead of having you know those something? four children, I, I would have liked to have the mother from Georgia. The pair of you would like there. to have the right to have a tank, and you don't agree because with, you with a single right. Now, a single now right. you're committing one. straw man, oh, President Obama's now you're proposals to gun control. And you know something? It makes me sick. When I hear people Pierce, say that kind Pierce. of thing, Pierce, Pierce, when did I say that? Pierce. It makes me sick when I when I hear people.